study weighing in on that age-old question, can money buy happiness? Previous research showed happiness peaked at around $75,000, but new research pops that number up. Okay, so look, before we can get to this. I mean, yeah. pops it up. Pops it up. Yeah, by um, a lot. By how much? So <laughs> now they're saying you can go well into $200,000 before yeah. you, know, you start to plateau. But they said they haven't researched past $500,000, so they think it could be even higher. Yeah. But they're thinking up to like $500,000. That's what. That's when you start to, well, you know, I've always said, right. Money can help provide things yeah. that bring you happiness, mm -hmm. right? But it but can also cause more issues. More money, more problems. Yeah. Yeah. Notorious B.I.G. Christopher Wallace said that. Yeah. So uh, this has always bothered me whenever we bring up this study mm -hmm. that it's the seventy, this magical seventy-five thousand right. dollar number that's mm -hmm. always talked about because that was actually a, a pretty big study that was done by mm -hmm. some pretty powerful yeah. economists like mm -hmm. these are mm -hmm. these are serious e economists and so another big time economist actually a nobel economist said eh, i don't second. know i'm not sure how i feel about this so i didn't know that this happened but the two economists then get together right. and say what is the real story here because your research says this and your yeah. research says this and we're both really good at what we do mm -hmm. so what's the reality and the previous study, the seventy-five grand, actually then gets debunked, yeah. which I think mm -hmm. is very cool that yes. they're willing to do that. It is so the, interesting. Yeah. I'm like to sit at that meeting. The, I know. You know. The two <laughs> biggest conclusions: happiness continues to rise with income, even in the high range of incomes, which we talked yeah. about. And then the second point was that twenty percent of the participants who had a higher income were in fact miserable. Mm -hmm. So going mm -hmm. to the fact that right. you know. Money that can't necessarily create everything. Wow. Now they also said there may have been other extenuating circumstances in your life, whether that was heartbreak, right. whether that was bereavement. Maybe you're also clinically depressed. Mm -hmm. Those are all factors that you know contribute right. to that yeah. too. Right. But if you think about it, money, as you said, it, it maybe it can't buy happiness, but it can make your life a lot easier, mm -hmm. right? So if you're constantly worrying about paying the oh, bills, yeah. or if you're constantly worrying about, am I, do we have enough food? Right. That mm -hmm. is a scary thing, and it really can affect your oh, yeah. happiness. Yeah, daily, on right? a daily occurrence, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, the, if you think about it, too, I wonder, like, when you're talking about, uh, with the exception of, you know, the bereavement mm -hmm. and that sort of thing, how many people get more in debt if you oh, make, sure. make more? Because you're like, yeah. oh, I can buy this, I can do this, mm -hmm. and then you, you know, add more right. to it. But Mm -hmm. Well, not only that, but then the study authors also said, look, your, the, your happiness scale, it's going to be a sliding scale on a day-to-day -day sure. basis. Yep. You know, right. how you feel one day is not necessarily how you're going to feel right. another day, too. Yeah. So that's something that you, that you have to keep in mind. Right. Mm -hmm. And that's why the researchers, what they did was they would just sort of ping people at different points throughout different days. Yeah. How are you feeling right now? Yeah. How are you feeling right now? And you get a wider picture because you're, you're right, you're not going to be happy every day. One of the, funny, one of the funniest comments said, look... I'd rather be, you know, rich and crying inside my Ferrari, <laughs> <laughs> you know, struggling to pay the bills every day. So there you go. There's, a, there's mm -hmm. something to think about there.